Testing one, two. How are we doing over here? Okay. This little microphone is really, really cool, man. It's that fine, fine microphone. Links are below. I'm shocked and impressed with how good the quality is for this little bitty thing. Today, I want to talk to you about how to price yourself as a photographer. You need to know your value. And I'm going to show you how to figure that out by a cool little equation I just came up with this morning. So many photographers ask me, how do you know what to charge? And it's, it's a wide question to answer, so I came up with this cool little equation that seems to work. Value equals experience and quality. Now, what goes into this is exactly what it seems like. Being in business is self-growth one inch a day. One inch a day. That is my theory because it's a long road. However, fast forwarding to where I am now, 26 years in business, this equation still applies to me. Absolutely, and I am still doing that one inch a day. You can ask my son. He's like, Dad, why do you watch all those videos on how to edit and do things in Final Cut Pro? It's like, why do you always learn, don't you know how to do that stuff? And I'm like, a lot of it. And I said, but if I learned one new thing by browsing and I could use it, that was my one inch a day. And it's funny because days later, we were talking about something and he goes, hey, Dad, was that your, uh, your one inch that you learned? And I'm like, yes, it was. Yes, it was. So, let's recap this. Now you have your time involved here. To charge for your services, that equation still holds true. When I tell you a Lexus, and I tell you a Toyota 4Runner, don't you have a difference in your mind of what's what? If I tell you my dad just bought a Lexus, not only do you understand what that Lexus vehicle is, you also have an idea for my dad. He must have a few dollars, to afford this Lexus. If I tell you the Toyota 4Runner is what I had in high school, naturally that makes sense. The quality difference is different, and they do make those two vehicles different. Here's the cool part. Toyota makes both. That one inch is still every day. Next year's model is gonna be a little bit more awesome. And the next year, and the next year, and their price gets more expensive, not less. That is you as the photographer. Your experience and your quality, your service, your likability, everything that you do that makes you your business should be increasing every year as well, which also means you should be charging a little more every year. That's how you grow. That's how you stay in business. But now we need to talk about something very, very important. Time. This is so important to me. So in the beginning, your time is valuable, but you're, you're putting that time in for yourself to learn. When you get to the point where your time is valuable because you can offer your clients all these things of the equation, then the value of what you charge should also be included. So here's the deal. If you don't know what a session fee is, it's something us older pro photographers created and it's one of those small baby things that helps us pay bills, just the basic necessity bills. So for me to go do an hour and a half session, it's gonna cost you $150. Another half hour coming back. Now we got almost three hours in just the session day, okay? So you may be saying, yeah, but you got 150 bucks. Okay, now I gotta find time to develop my raw images for my client. I need to get ready to present to them. I need to show them my favorite images that I want them to purchase from. I do not show them every single image. That's not your job. That's a whole nother video, by the way. It'll take me close to an hour to do one person's regular session. So can you imagine how long it takes me to process a wedding with two to 3,000 images? when a single session sometimes is in the three, four, 500 image range. It depends on how much fun we're having. All of those things are what I'm saying is worth $150. Not just the one hour and a half, 
we're going to shoot, I'm 150. It's the fact that I'm tying in all of this time that's going to take for me to service you. Now, when you order beyond that, that's the plus. That's the lanyard. That's how we take on more in our life. It's how you stay in business. $150 for a session and you give somebody the images, you, you have no business. <laughs> You're learning, which is fantastic. So, I'm curious, what is your time worth for you? If you are a working photographer or a new person that wants to charge, maybe you have been charging and you're not getting a lot of good feedback from what you're charging, ask yourself, does the equation equal your value? You, your value. I keep growing. You need to keep growing as an artist. If you're still doing the same tricks you were doing two months ago, ask yourself why. Never be comfortable with yourself, ever. Always expect more from yourself and always want to give more to the people that want to hire you because there is nothing more important to you than understanding your own value. You can't sell yourself if you don't know what you're worth. Toyota knows that Lexus vehicle that they're making with all that leather and technology and all the million things that goes into creating that Lexus, they know their value. They do. And what they're selling those cars for is not just how they're making the cars, the nuts and bolts and tires. It's also the executives and the marketing boards and the teams of people and the research. All of that goes into the cost of the Lexus. That's how you figure out your personal value as a photographer, or anything that you're actually selling, honestly. Those pair of jeans that you bought at the store were made for probably under $5 a piece, but they're selling them for 60? They created value somewhere. They created the want, the need, and the value, and they're getting it. You know what I'm saying? Whew. That was a lot. I hope you, and I hope you, got something out of this, please in the comments, let me know if, do you know your value and do you feel good charging what you charge? Or you need to start charging and you don't know where to go. Maybe you don't know what your work looks like and you don't have any service that you've been giving people, so how do you market that? What you show is what you get. So show what you wanna attract, no matter how little or how much it is, and you will continue to get what you show back as clients. So that one inch a day is your goal, one inch. All right, you guys, I am George Kushler, owner of GK Photography here in New Orleans. This is my YouTube channel, Focus with GK. I want you to be focused on your photography, your business, your life, your relationships. There's so many things to be focused on in this world and not be distracted by the negativity, all right? Together as one, we all move on Stay focused on your dreams, and I will see you in the next video, all right? That was fun. We all think about the, the double angle thingy happening here. I learned something. I'll share that with about, about Final Cut Pro a little later on. Y'all be good. <laughs> see you later.